What's going on guys? It's Morsebringe back with Season 6 to the Pokemon Road to Victory series. After a rocky ending on Season 5, we are now on the 3DS. Hopefully that will go a little bit smoother, a little bit better here on the newer gen console, I want to say. However, it's still a fairly old game now. But let's get right into this. With the underside of this Pokeball. Get Moon. Not time for Moon yet. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. I am Augustine Sycamore, the Kalos region's very own Pokemon professor. This world of ours is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. These mysterious creatures can be found in every corner of our world. Some run across the plains, others fly through the skies, and others yet swim deep in the oceans. We live together with these Pokemon, lending our strength to one another to live and prosper. Let's get started with some quick questions. Are you a boy or are you a girl? I am a boy. What do you look like? Darker haired. Oh, I see. Would you tell me your name? I believe this is... First generation, we can put our whole name in here. Morris Bringe, that is our name. This Morris Bringe then, did I get that right? Yes. Morris Bringe, tres bien, what a fantastic name. Your adventure begins now. You are about to enter the beautiful Colors region. Go and meet many Pokemon and people and fill your life with experience. Woohoo! On to the Colors region! With Fletchling. I definitely like Fletchling. It's a good Pokemon. Probably one of the best early bird or early rot birds. Get murked by our, our Fletchling there. Ah, we have friends now. I guess we have no friends. Let's see. So this is strange. Okay. It's a Wii U. The gamepad even has a screen. How fancy. It shows us in the mirror. Looked in the mirror. And changed clothes. If only it were that easy. All right. Onward with our journey. Time to talk to Mom. Morning, Mars Brings. You sure slept well. All rested up from the move. It's about time you got going. Why don't you step out and say hello to the neighbors? Because I don't want to. You can't make me, Mom. I don't want to talk to the neighbors. I don't know how I'm losing frames. This is not this expansive of a game. Welcome to Vanderbilt Town. My name's Serena. I'm your neighbor. And I'm Shana. Great to meet you. Guess what? We've come to get you. The esteemed Professor of Sycamore lives here in the Kalos region. I was told he has a request for five kids, including us. But I'm a little surprised he knows who you are. You did just move to Vanderbilt Town. Or Vanderbilt, after all. We'll wait for you in the next town over. And you know what? We're going to get a Pokemon. Come on, hurry. Let's go. To Aquacord. Over this way. I guess that's over here, yeah. We were just talking about you. Come on, have a seat. This is the meeting place, Morsbench. Here, let me introduce you. Everyone, this is Morsbench. Wow, Shauna's description was spot on. So, Marsman, this is Tierno. He's got some serious dance moves, and this is Trevor. He never misses a single question on his test, but he's a little shy. All right, nice to meet ya! You know, it feel like we're closer crew if we call each other by nicknames. Can I call you M. Meister? What? No way, he's a little M for sure. What do you think, Trevor? You, the, what? Sean, you shouldn't put people on the spot like this. Well, how about something low-key? Maybe like Big M. Why don't you decide what we should call you? I think you should call me by my name. I guess we can go by the actual nickname we've gone for for the rest of the series. Moors, which is shorten it. 
want us to call you Boris? Sure. Why not? Fit you perfectly. I'm sure we're gonna be great friends. I'll call you that too. I want to meet my new partner soon. I know, right? It was such a cool feeling when Travis and I met our Pokemon. Hope you feel the same way we did. Oh, you already have Pokemon? Why did they get Pokemon before me? Choose a Pokemon! Chespin, Finnegan, and Froakie. I think we're gonna go with Froakie. Big fan of Froakie. Like water type starters too. You wanna give him a name? Sure! Uh, this can be Bubs, short for Bubbles. It was my first Green Ninja's name. It was Bubbles. Yeah, we've decided on Bubs. You picked Finnegan, so I can be super effective against you. And you picked Chespin. We got a Pokedex, so we can learn about Pokemon. We got the professor's letter. What does that do? All right, we've done with our errand from the professor. Guess Travis and I will go look for Pokemon. Well, that's not very helpful. Kids are chosen to carry your Pokedex and go on an adventure, but you need to give that letter to your mom before you go. Why does it always send us home? Like, is that like an immersion thing? Morris, wait. I just told you to go. Why won't, don't you just stop going and come back? Alright, Shauna. Let's battle. I think this is the first generation we have a water type move at starter level. I think, yeah. I really expected that to be a little more damage there. Wow, level six. She paid me $500 and then healed up my Pokemon. I barely took any damage. Give the letter to our mom. Yeah, mom, we got our own Pokemon. We're main character. Why did she come down the stairs backwards? The town map. Cool, we can know where we're at. Alright, where's the door that only sells Pokeballs? Sure, let's get a, get a couple of Pokeballs. Hey, Pokemon trainer, if you set foot in the tall grass, wild Pokemon will pop out. You'll be fine, because your Pokemon partner will battle for you. That's great. Time to fight our Pidgey. Oh, and then we have to go deal with Shauna. What if we don't? Oh, we still have to. Yay! Oh, hi, Mars. Come learn how to hit Pokemon with me. I really don't want to. Wow! The wild Pokemon went inside the Pokeball? What did you think happened? Oh, now I got more Pokeballs. I just went and wasted all my money on Pokeballs. Makes your Pokemon stronger too. Oh yeah, this generation did include that, where you could catch them to gain XP. Instead of having to defeat them in battle. Hey, and it's a Fletchling! Um, I do want one of these. One, two, three stars. This can be torch. Oh, cool, it's you again. All right, are you gonna heal me? Can anyone do anything? Yeah, you can, okay, I did not know you could do that. Well, good time. Your Pokemon are in for a shock. 
a random electric type trainer out here? Oh, you got a Pikachu. Definitely not an electric type trainer. Brought the worst electric type there is. Hey, Torch leveled up. Torch leveled up a lot. That really helped Torch out a lot. Alright, I think we are out of the force now. We do have potential. This is our sixth region to conquer in a row. Overt way, what are y'all going to do? Look for my Pokemon, sure. Oh yeah, we. This is the first gym leader, so we need, do need to go do that real quick. You know what kind of Pokemon I need to bring? That's oh, a Burmy. We'll catch it. I don't know how long it'll stay on the team, but we'll catch it. Protect the Burmy. Since clearly protect works for this Pokemon. Santon City. Alright, let's go ahead and heal up. Oh, there's Tierna. You're coming to get your Pokemon healed. You can even deposit your Pokemon in the PC. Watch me dance. Oh yeah, you have to have the roller skates to get into the gym at this one. Hey stranger, isn't cruising around town on your roller skates best thing ever? What? Do you mean to tell me that you don't even own a pair of roller skates? Then how about this? If you beat me in a Pokemon battle, I'll give you a pair. I can never say no to a contest. Not me, so how about it? Sure, you let's battle. That is Zigzagoon. You have a Zigzagoon. That is your whole team. Your top speed. It wasn't like you were using a rollout team. Alright. When we use the circle pad, we'll put on the roller skate. Can we not spin yet? To spin something you learn later? I guess where you could spin at the beginning. Alright. Got a good chance at a bug type. Okay, that's disconnected there. Can you just get to Viola without? Uh, okay, I was about to say, can you just get here without battling anybody else? But apparently, Last Charlotte is going to stop us from that with her Kakuna. That I kind of doubt knows anything too threatening other than Harden. Just to make this take longer. No fair. All right, up to Viola. I 
The determined expression, that glint in your eye, that says you're up to it. The challenge, it's fantastic, just fantastic. Is this your first time challenging a gym? Fantastic. Whether it's the tears or frustration that follow a loss, or the blossoming of joy that comes with a victory, they're both great subjects for my camera. Fantastic. That'll just be fantastic. Now come at me. My lens is always focused on victory. I won't let anything ruin this shot. Versus Iola. She got some fun music. All right, let's go peck. Oh, okay, you got the quick peck. It's level 10, so we... I don't know. I know we win the Sir Skip battle. Alright, here's that. The pavilion. We'll keep battling. Keep going for Peck. This one is gonna be bug flying. But I don't think flying resists itself. No. Alright, pavilion's level 12, so I don't think we are a high enough level to take this battle on yet. Super effective. Infest station will take us over. Torch will faint. So let's learn Bubs. See what Bubs can do here. Bubs is only level 10. Let's see. Lick should apply because this is a bug flying type. We do get a chance to paralyze. It's not going to work here. Let's, let's see what Bubble does. It's got Stab. Oh, Potion, okay. Well, that was not all of its HP. I kind of expected it to at least recover all of its HP there. That was a crit? Oh, Bubbles is not ready for this. The termites are eating us. Let's tackle. Woo! Okay, so the pavilion's down. Alright, we're up to level 11 now. We're up to level 12 now. Nice, nice. Oh, she only had two. Okay. Awesome. Young trainer, you know it wasn't you alone. You and your Froki have shown me a whole new depth of field. Fantastic. Just fantastic. Here we got the insect badge. Bug badge. Okay. With that bug badge, Pokemon up to level 30 will listen to your orders in battle. Yep, even if you get them from trades. And here, this team commemorates your win against a pro photog like me. Infestation, okay. A DOT move would be nice. Using a team like that one there lets you teach your Pokemon some new moves quicker than a shutter. Set to 1 1,000th 1, can snap shut. TMs and some of the best TMs are some of the best gear around. They're point and click easy, and you can use them over and over again. Now, the TM that I just gave you is for the move called Infestation. Use it, and it'll be impossible for your opponent to flee from battle. Now then, can you zoom in a bit to check out the tent behind me? Take the stairs that you find beyond it, and you'll be back up to the entrance faster than a flash. Alrighty. Alright. The 3D is cool, but it is kind of hard to navigate sometimes. Whoa ho ho! Would you look at that bug badge? Nice. Very nice future champ. I bet that Schmancy Pains professor who gave you your first Pokemon would be amazed to see it. 
After you heal up your Pokemon in the Pokemon Center, why don't you head up to the Pokemon Lab in Lumio City and show it to them, huh? Alright. Um... Yeah, for sure want to come down here and heal. But that is the gym badge collected, so that'll be the end of today's episode. Hopefully all have enjoyed as we started out on this new journey. But make sure to leave a like so I know what y'all enjoy. Subscribe to be notified for more comment, and leave me a comment down below for some Pokemon you'd like to see in the run. I do try and nickname them after whoever comments. Uh, the recommended Pokemon, and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace out.